Hi Libra, welcome to your Week Ahead Taroscope with me, Raphael, from Radiant Reality. It's an absolute pleasure to have you. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for joining me. Quick note, these are for your Sun, Moon and Ascendant sign. Whether you're sun, uh, remember to watch all three so that you know which part of you I resonate with most as a reader. Before we start, as always, I would like to bless my decks of cards with all forms of love, light, peace, prosperity and abundance. And I pray that the messages that come through are ultimately clear and concise. And they help you on your path to your highest vibrational good. So, for your key to the week, if you are a continued subby, you know Rafi loves you. And if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like, share and if you should so choose and it resonates, hit the subscribe button. Your key this week is the Emperor. So, this week, you are not just uh, establishing yourself, but you are also commanding each one of these spheres of your life. It also looks like you might be putting your foot down this week, whereby you position yourself, or at least, like, maybe you decide to pull rank in all of these different areas of life for any number of reasons. We'll have a look in a moment what those might be. Uh, but it also looks like you are positioning yourself like the expert. This is you kind of using the knowledge, the wisdom, the expertise that you've gained over a lifetime and kind of saying, okay, you know what, now it's time for this to work for me. For your actions and options, you've got the page of pentacles. So for a lot of you, this could literally be that you decide to do some form of, some kind of formal study. Um, I wouldn't be surprised actually, and if whatever you are studying or deciding to study this week feeds directly into your work, it's also going to uh, in, uh, to in, uh, 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 enhance or increase your earning potential, but almost immediately. Right? Maybe when I say almost immediately, I'm, what I mean is it's not going to be like a three year degree and then you have to buy, you know, get a graduate job and blah, blah, blah. It's like whatever you start to learn, you'll be able to start utilizing it almost immediately, like certainly within the next three months. Right? And this will enhance your earning potential. So I love this for you when it comes to your um, the options that are available to you. This is a chance for you to really figure out what it is that you are doing, right? What it is that you are doing with your life, what it is that you really want for yourself, and more importantly, how you can make that happen on a practical level. So it's a pretty big week, right? No pressure. When it comes to your communications and conversations, you've got the two of cups, love this, right? Partnerships, collaborations, connections, these are the things that are really going to get you ahead this week. This with the Emperor card though, you have to be prepared to lead. You've got to be prepared to be the person that puts all of this together, right? And it's kind of like, you know, that uh, the, the saying or the meme that goes around that says, you know, they'll mock you until you've done it because they don't understand what you're building. This might be a week like that where you have to kind of wrangle the, not wrangle, rally the troops, but you know, you might find that nobody is really that receptive because at the moment they can't see it but once you've done it and you've started to gain some traction you will see they will be on side so it's up to you this week to be the not the cheerleader but the bellwether right you've got to be that person at the forefront to say look you can't see it yet let me sell you this vision when it comes to those of you that are studying or in some form of academia literally right not only do you learn things or take on board new information that can become lucrative relatively soon it also connects you to people, to the right people that are going to be able to help you build whatever this vision might be. For those of you that are um, employed by somebody else, the emperor is your boss, right? Whether you're a man or a woman, it's kind of irrelevant. Like the emperor is your boss. This is you partnering up with your boss. Now you might think to yourself like, Raph, I don't know about that, right? I would not be surprised if your boss comes to you and says, there's a new project going on this week. We'd really like you to work with us on it or to be a part of it. That means we will be working together quite a lot. Um, now, if you're single, it's not a problem. If you are partnered, just watch out for this because, you know, sparks could fly. Uh, you know, so there could be like a little bit of a flirtation, darling. Um, for those of you that are business owners, entrepreneurs, solopreneurs, people that work for themselves, this is what you've been waiting for. This is the investor in your business. It's the person saying, you've got the green light, you've got the go ahead, I wanna work with you on dot, dot, dot. This is you finding the right partnership that's gonna help you drive things forward. 
I love this for you, right? It puts you in a very strong position and it also means that you are partnering up with the right people or rather the right businesses, okay? For those of you that are retired and no longer working, you're just so focused on your marriage and your relationship this week. If you're single and retired and no longer working, this week it's almost like you're saying to yourself, you know what, the world is my oyster, what am I gonna do with it? For your love and relations, look at that, you got the Ten of Cups. If you are partnered, married, or in a long-term commitment, your relationship really is in a very strong place this week. And that Ten of Cups, it means that you find not just an even keel with your partner, but you start to get back to the optimum, Ooh, excuse me, the optimum of the relationship, right? I actually really like that because it means that you're very focused on bringing that to the fore. So there's like you trying to get not only the most out of the relationship, but it's like, what do we need as a collective? All of the, the choices and the decisions that you're making, you're making as a collective, but with you at the helm. And I think this is what's making the change, right? You are commanding the space to say, okay, this is where we're going. This is how we're going to do it. And you be in that firm hand on the tiller is going to get everything to move forward for those of you that are single and looking to mingle you've got the two of cups and the ten of cups right the story of the two of cups the two of cups wants to be the ten of cups this is true love attainment happiness accomplishment emotional contentment uh, resources wealth all of that good stuff this is a love card but this card wants to be this card right so this is love this is true love right now because you've got this here with the emperor for a lot of you, if you're single this week, you could be connecting with somebody who we would consider an absolute boss or a beast at whatever they do. Like this is someone who really knows their stuff, somebody that's very well educated, potentially as well. This person could be in law enforcement, they could be in, uh, you know, a professor of some sort or something along those lines. Whoever they are though, I can tell you, this person's got smarts, they know what they're doing, okay? For your money and materials this week you have the three of wands okay this is an entrepreneurial card if ever i saw one right so this is you making more money from your endeavors this is you really speculating to accumulate and it paying off the three of wands also sees you taking stock of what uh, knowledge skills um, resources as well that you have right now that you can pour back into this now i will say uh, you know, you can Elon Musk the shit out of this, you know, like, uh, I don't know if you know that story about Elon Musk. So once him and his brother sold PayPal, he put literally every penny he had into Tesla. He was sleeping on someone's couch. Like this is bearing in mind, you, this guy's just made multi, multi millions, right? Puts every single penny of it back into Tesla and is sleeping on somebody's couch to give himself the, the fire up the backside in order to, to smash it out, right? And look, just like, and I always use him as an example, and it's not because I like him or whatever his agendas or whatever the case might be are, I just really love the grit that he has. Um, that's just me as a person. I love people that have grit. I love people that have guts and balls or, you know, tits for the lady. Um, do you know what I mean? I like people that are like, you know what? I'm gonna put myself in this uncomfortable situation. I'm just gonna make it work. I have a lot of respect for people that do that. And so his is always the example that I kind of give myself in the back of my mind to like, you know, do it. Don't just get comfortable and complacent. Do what you need to do. And so this week, it really feels like you're finding that flow within yourself. I'm so excited for you, Libra. When it comes to your um, physical health and vitality, this is a lot of the mind, right? And so the, the thing that I do want to say to you this week, the mind could really be doing 10 to the dozen. And obviously, when our mind is so busy, we tend to see that we, you know, it can, when your mind is exhausted, it can exhaust your body. So just watch out for that this week. When it comes to your home and environment, it looks like a lot of you won't be necessarily spending too much time at home this week or the home is in flux. And so again, you have to be that person to be kind of calling the shots in some way. With that said, I wish you an abundance of all of that good stuff. Have a fantastic week. Let me know in the comments how it shapes up. Take care and I'll see you soon.